hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to insert a diagram from Droyo in google docs let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in google docs i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Inserting a Droyo diagram into Google Docs is a simple process that can be done by exporting the diagram and embedding it in the document. So, here, the first thing that you need to do is to export from Droyo your diagram that you have created. Right? And of course, insert it into Google Docs. How? All that have to do is hover to the file section on the upper left corner. You have an option to, let me save this for now. It pays to check the uh, file so that the recent updated uh, version is going to be saved accordingly now you want to make sure that you go to the file section and of course go to the section that says export all right so you have multiple options here you can export as png jpeg webp and svg or pdf but i'm just gonna use the svg now svg is one of the best in terms of um, exporting or embedding in different formats because um, the idea is svg is a high resolution pngs which is better which has a better clarity for google docs all right from here you might want to choose the transparent background or if you don't want just click the dark background and appearance you can include shadows if you want you can embed images embed fonts and a lot more all right all i have to do is click the export button now you have two options here which we are going to explore both number one option is google drive or google drive and pick a folder if you want or go to the download button i'm going to click the download button because it will directly save it to my local computer once the file has been downloaded let's switch over to google docs very quickly now from here you can start with a template for your google docs or you can simply click the template gallery it would be forwarded here to choose from any of the following that you want to choose but we're going to choose the blank document for now we will be forwarded here in this blank document wherein we can have the capability to rename the file and of course from here insert the uh, image that we have exported from Droyo. click the insert button you have multiple options in uh, image of course, again, we're going to use the uh, from drive, which we're going to explore later. But for now, I'm going to use the upload from computer. Now, this is the inserted diagram from Droyo. All right. Now, the next option is we're going back again to the Droyo platform. In this instance, the next thing that we're going to do is to explore is go again to the file. We're going to export it as this time it's going to be a JPEG. But thing is we're gonna click the light appearance click the export button you can choose also if it's going to be a diagram or the whole page or you can set in a border if you want well, we're going to click on the export now we're going to choose google drive you can pick a folder if you want but let's let me click the uh, google drive for now click on save button checks a little while all right now you see normally it would ask us to uh, authorize google drive here in Droyo, but since we have a separate video on how we have integrated the both so we're not going to be asked now we're going very quickly to the google docs here i'm gonna press enter i'm gonna make it a little bit smaller press enter so that the two images can fit go to the insert button go to the image and click the my drive let me do that again click image from google drive and you see you should be able to have an option to insert any of the following formats all right i want you to click on it and click on the insert button so there you go you have now inserted let me just resize this for now so you guys can see it so you have two options here once you're happy with it now you have an option to save it or send it to your client you can give them an access from as a viewer only, commenter, or editor, depending on your preference. And of course, if you're working with multiple freelancers, this is going to be like the efficient way for you to get feedbacks, comment, and a lot more. All right. So basically, that's how you insert a diagram from Droyo going to Google Docs. 
Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.